Hi, Mario Link 64 here, and I'm taking over Mass Fog. That's right, I'm completely taking over. I got more energy. Why does it blur it out? I got more stamina. I got more ideas. And I got more. Yeah, pwned. My energy drink. <laughs> Sorry for the interruption. I'm an F and I'm taking over this vlog. I'm breaking my way, I'm bonking my way to the top of the scoreboards. I'm the scout in TF2. I'm awesome. Hello. Oh. Why is everyone trying to take over my vlog? And by the way, this is my math laser. And yes, it is a calculator taped to a Wii Zapper. It is awesome. Thank you. I have something very important to tell you. I have created a short intro that will be in all my future videos. I have worked very hard on it. So please enjoy it. Or else you'll upset me and you don't want to upset me, do you? Play the intro. Math vlog. Awesome point. Hello, math vlog viewers, math fans, uh, vlog watchers. What do I call you guys? How about math watchers? Yeah, that's cool. Math watchers. Although that kind of makes you all sound like stalkers. Perfect! Hello, math watchers. This is Math Answers Questions Part 2. Yeah. In this video, I will answer questions asked by you. Unless you didn't send me a question, in which case I'm not going to answer a question because you didn't send me one and that wouldn't make sense. But before I do that, I'm going to talk about awesome lists. After the part one video, I decided that every Math Answers Questions video will have an awesome list to go along with it. It is basically a list of people who are awesome. Mostly my fans. For part one, I decided that the awesome list will be anyone who sent me a question, so that's pretty easy. But for the second one, I sent subliminal messages in some of my videos in the form of really quick annotations uh, giving you directions on how to get on the awesome list which was to send me a question in a YouTube message with the subject line binary and only a few people did that so I'm going to read off to you the awesome list for this video the awesome list for this video is in this order Mr. Card Player Spectre Hater Crew iTricon Fire Pro Voltron and Mario Link 64. As before, all the questions will be listed in annotations and function notation. Jeffrey XCM asks, What kind of deck do you recommend most for XCM? For practice, I would recommend bicycle cards or studs, the cheap kinds, the red and blue. But for performances out in public, out in nature, I would recommend Tally Hoes or some E-Decks, not all of them, some of them, but Tally Hoes are better. How's life going for you? Well, very good, thanks for asking. Based on your question, you seem like a really nice person. Do you want Donkey Kong to kill you? I take that back, you upset me. My first instinctual reaction would be to say, no, I do not want Donkey Kong to kill me. But I wonder, why would you ask me that question if there wasn't some chance that I would want him to kill me? I think the only situation in which I would want Donkey Kong to kill me is if I was that cardboard cutout boss from Donkey Kong 64, and his killing me would mean that he wins the boss battle. And why Donkey Kong? Why not any other video game character? This is important stuff we're talking about here. Let's keep talking about it. Next question. Fire Pro Voltron asks... Revenge! That's not a question. Oh. If you and Gambit had an XCM battle, who would win? Chuck Norris. If you could have one superpower, what would it be? Well, either the ability to deflate your annoying red afro, or the ability to make you stop asking me so many questions. Do I get an awesome point for every question that I ask? No, stop sending me so many questions. Everyone else can, just not you. Mr. Card Player asks, Can you make a video where you show some XCM cuts? You're welcome. Next question. Mario Link 64 asks, How long does it take to make your gaff cards? Well, the process of scratching out the cards and printing the designs on them doesn't really take that long, but uh, the... Oh, here we go. But the actual designing of the card designs can take a really long time, anywhere from about half an hour to an eternity. Mario or Sonic? Yes. Nerd or nerd? Lol what? Spectre Hater Crew, or ew, asks, 
How much time did you spend flourishing on your trip to the Northeast? Uh, well, I did this magic trick for a statue of Benjamin Franklin in Philadelphia. And in Amherst, I spent about 15 or so minutes filming this stuff with this awesome point in nature in the background. That was mostly it. For those of you who saw the five-part series about the trip, I was very busy the whole time with looking at colleges that would determine my future and whatnot. I, Tricon, asks, what are you planning on doing in the future, job-wise? I plan to be the next Bill Gates slash Stephen Hawking slash Dan or Dave Buck without, you know, the money, the neurological disease, or the twin brother. Do you ever plan on visiting Japan? If so, come to Kyoto. Actually, I did get to go to Japan once when I was three, so I don't really remember any of it. I would love to go again, just so that I could be considered normal for once. Not that being weird is a bad thing. And also, I could go to Kyoto and apologize for all of America for not approving the Kyoto Protocol. Why? Do you speak any Japanese? I know very little Japanese, but there are a few words that I use almost daily. For example, every day I come home from school and if my mom's home I'll say, Okaidi, and then she'll say, Tadaima. Okaidi kind of means like, I'm home, and Tadaima meaning, yes you are. And also whenever we sit down to eat we say, uh, Ididakimasu, which means like, we're gonna eat now, and yeah. And when we're finished with dinner we say, Gojitosama, which means, may I be excused. I also know the word unchi, which kind of means, um, I'd, I'd rather not say it. Alright, I'm done with my questions! Okay, this is stupid. Math Watchers, I have a very big surprise for you! Cue the surprise! Yeah, the evil remote is back. Shoot, need a battery. And here it is. Yeah, ooh ha ha ha, ha ha Evil remote is back. Ha 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 ha. We still haven't gotten a battery for it, so it doesn't really like. Yeah, I can do that, and it doesn't do anything. But we're gonna get a battery for it, and I'm going to use it. Keep on using it. So uh, this is math reminding you to perfect your art and then make it even awesomer. Like the, the but. <laughs> The way. Why is the toilet covered in chocolate? Yes, it cool. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I. All right, guys. What was I supposed to say? Get, get, get off me! Uh -huh. No, it's fine. Don't do that again. <laughs>